Would I be the a-hole if I got my family friend fired for telling my mom that I was pregnant? That's a situation. That's a situation and a half. Situation. No, not talking gym tan laundry Jersey Shore. (laughs) I, 20 female, recently found out I'm pregnant, which came as a surprise because I'm on birth control. I made an appointment with an OB that's close to me with high ratings to confirm the pregnancy. And when I walked in, I was immediately concerned because the woman behind the desk is a friend of my mom's, which is like concerning because like, what if you don't want to keep the baby or, you know, and if you're in a conservative state, like they're not super close. I hadn't seen her in years, but they've known each other since high school. And I know they sort of keep in touch. I didn't feel ready to tell anyone other than my boyfriend and obviously doctor about the baby. So I was freaking out a little bit, but my boyfriend assured me that she wouldn't be able to say anything to my mom about the baby without my consent, which is like, Uh, you know, doctor patient privilege, right? Right. That makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah. And especially again, especially in, you know, states like, like Texas where abortion laws are, are really not on a billboard, (laughs) not on a billboard. When I got home, my mom was waiting for me because she already knew about the baby. Apparently her friend had texted to congratulate her before I could even make it home. Oh, so she didn't even like think she was like ratting on her. Yeah. She was like, like, Oh, congrats on the new baby. Apparently her friend had texted to congratulate her before I could even make it home. Everything is going to be okay. And my mom is being supportive, but honestly, I'm pissed at this lady and I want to report her to the OB. Yeah. My family is supportive of the baby, but if she had opened her big mouth to someone with a different kind of family, the outcome could have been really bad. True. My boyfriend agrees with me, but thinks it's kind of Karen-ish. And on the other hand, (laughs) my mom thinks her friend crossed a few lines, but to report her and potentially put her employment at risk would be a pretty a-hole move. I think my mom's friend is an a-hole and a potentially dangerous one at that. Would I be the a-hole for reporting her big mouth to her employer? Wow, that's a... Honestly, for me, this is a tough one. Yeah, it is tough. It is tough because it's like a family friend and nothing bad happened. Nothing bad happened. What if it was someone else? I just just don't like the fact of like... Even though she had the purest of intentions, I don't like the fact that it's like a medical professional telling other people like my yeah that's supposed to be confidential that's a breach of patient you know doctor confidentiality definitely um and if you one of your employees is doing that like as a doctor i would want to know um but the confusing part is it's a family friend and like nothing bad happened to you yeah uh but it's also like you know you're probably going to make things really uncomfortable for oh for sure i mean yeah, I mean it'll be it'll be an uncar- it doesn't sound like they're super close or anything, but like but still, yeah. It's not it's it like won't it won't be responsible fun. for anyone getting fired is no not like a fun yeah. thing to do unless yeah. unless you're a Karen and you love that kind of stuff. Yes. <laughs> Hell Karen's love. Karen's live for that, that shit. <laughs> <laughs> uh well, so what what would you say? Dude, that's so hard. Honestly, I would be initially I would be pissed. Yeah. I would be super pissed. Um and maybe in that moment I'd just like pull the trigger and and call them and tell them but maybe not i don't know i would have to i would have to to sit on it but honestly i could i could see myself i could see myself doing it and telling see like my rationale is you know one it didn't hurt me right yeah yeah but um but it could hurt someone else so in the interest of the greater good and of that person that really could have their life messed up by something like this um she should uh she should be talked to but i don't think it necessarily goes through talking to the employer i think she could give like a warning or a talk directly to that family friend that's a responsible thing to do this was not okay for you to do um luckily my parents are supportive but um if you do this again you could get fired uh and you know look out for your best look out for your self-interest but also the self-interest but but also the interests of the patients. Um, and I think that would actually be as good of a preventative behavior, measure, yeah, yeah, beha- beha- yeah. Preventative measure yeah. as calling the employer. That's a mature thing to do, or you could just blow up her freaking life. <laughs> or just bam, big Boom. crater. Yeah, that's the story. Uh, but if you uh, want to make sure you don't blow up this great relationship we have with you, the listener, what, what what should they do, John? Guys, give us a follow. Give Where, us a follow. Wherever Subscribe. You're, Come on. Wherever you're consuming this right now, just click it. Yeah. And we love you. You know, subscribe. Have yeah. a few laughs. You know, stick around for a while. That's right. 
Okay. Go pee.